friends, I'm Ryan. This is Demos in the Dark. Sit back, relax. We're going to talk about a Pinter guitar model, the SB1S. Now, if you've been around the channel, you know that I am an owner of a Pinter guitar. I have an SB1J, and uh, J stands for jazz, and this has low output pickups. It has flat wound strings on it. And it could not be any more different than the one that we're going to be looking at today. We're looking at today is the SB1S. Now, this is a rock machine. The SB1S has an older body with a maple neck pow ferro board, 22 frets, 24 and 3 quarter scale. We have a compound 10 to 16 inch radius on the fingerboard jumbo frets neck profile is a modern c this thing weighs next to nothing then we come to this pickup right here this is a custom righteous sound pickup it is a beast it's 13k output hex it's wild so it has a master volume and a master tone you can add a control bypass as well if you want to when you are customizing your own this one here has a hip shot tremolo bridge you can also spec it with a hip shot hardtail bridge we have hip shot locking tuners there and we have an ultra light nitro finish on here very cool in that track i focus mostly on the heavy sounds that this guitar is capable of uh, and that was the polished part. Now we're coming into the not polished part. Listen, when I go into a guitar store to try out a piece of gear, I don't have an arsenal of licks and riffs at my disposal. I find endless soloing to be a distraction. Typically what I do is I play long cowboy chords, very simple parts so I can concentrate on what the instrument is doing without the distractions. So we're going to start with some clean sounds. For that, I am running into a silk tone amp, silk tone amp. And then after that, we're going to plug into a heavier amp and we can get some of those sounds. So here we go. That tone knob is really, really useful, even just in like a clean straight into the amp kind of thing. Um, you can really, really change the sound, really soften it up and um, super, super useful. So um, let's try some pedals, you know, um, let's uh, let's grab some overdrive. We'll grab a barber gain changer first. <laughs> Cool. 
let's try some distortion with the 1981 Inventions DRV. <laughs> Cuff Caprid 2. Let's see how that sounds. This is the Big Muff style pedal. <laughs> plugged into the Henry Amps Pasadena Rose, which is a take on Eddie Van Halen's super lead. And this is where this thing just shines. It just comes to life. <laughs> guitars sibling to my sb1 j this is certainly the rowdier and raunchier sibling um to my sb1 j very very cool it has a, a same great body shape which is very ergonomic very comfortable when you're sitting or standing um it's modern and vintage all at the same time and uh it's just a cool cool guitar i really really like it if you are one who plays rock music this would be an easy pick for you. So thank you, Michael, for sending this over for me to check out. And thank you for the privilege of your time. Yeah. 